I guess I just really like the the science, and uh, I feel like life itself is like beautiful. It's all around us. So by me uh, studying biology, I was able to I'm able to uh, learn more about everyday interactions with the earth. Um, to be honest, I was kind of fed up with doing chemistry at a main campus. And uh, one of my professors they, uh, mentioned uh, that they had research opportunities here at TFO. And I was like, it, it seemed like a perfect match for what I was looking to do. So uh, just w went on from there. So right now there's not a, um, there's not like one core project. Uh, majority of what we're doing uh, collaboratively is focusing on like the maintenance of certain uh, long-term projects, like the uh, dendro bands, the maintaining the sea traps and uh, like just general maintenance like that. My personal project is uh, comparing the effects of uh, standing biomass to uh, seed dispersal. Um, so pretty much what I'm doing is gathering uh, seeds from all the seed traps and uh, identifying the species of seeds and how those seeds uh, disperse themselves. Uh, and then I'm comparing that to how many trees uh, and uh, shrubs and other woody plants are standing in those areas. All right, so the, the goal of my project is uh, uh, to pretty much analyze how uh, the seed dispersal is being affected by the, uh, the tornado that recently hit Ampler. Um, so I, I'm just comparing uh, to the Robinson's Park, which I'm using as my control, uh, like how, how their um, dispersal mechanisms are varying. So uh, personally, the benefits I see is that, uh, like, I I'm a hands-on learner. So by me being able to go out, go out into the field, uh, collect data, uh, have wonderful people helping me with the data entry, I'm, I feel like I'm actually learning how to, how to conduct research rather than just reading a textbook as I would in my normal uh, STEM classes.